what are we going to do this time? We Chinese. No. We're not. Mm -hmm. Hi, everybody. It's Hello. Okay, no, that's not me. I don't Just know. Hands. If <laughs> fun doing the episode last time. Uh, we got some good yeah. feedback. And some feedback. And some feedback. Um, I'm Michelle. I'm Ben. I'm the mom. The son. And we are just a couple crazy knitters. Well, at least one crazy knitter. A little bit. Um, yeah. It's kind of been a different week this week. Uh, I've been knitting like an animal, and <laughs> Ben has not had the bug at all this week. I've started. But would you say it's been a chore this N week? Knitting? Yeah. No. It was uh, a fun thing. It was a fun thing, but have you wanted to do it? <laughs> yeah, that's why I was knitting. No, all week long. Yeah, I just didn't want to do it as that time because I had to get my homework done. Sure, you have homework to worry about. I do not have homework to worry about, so I can just knit, 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 knit. I have to worry about school. Yes. And then knit. Yes. He's got spring break coming up, so he'll have a little extra knitting time then, but he's going away. So we'll get to hear about that. I have a retreat coming up this next weekend. I don't get to go. He does not get to go. But um, we are we, it's a Thursday through Sunday. And we're gonna do some yarn dyeing. And I wanna do that so badly. We can do it here sometime. Maybe we'll, we'll maybe we'll tape it. Yeah. yeah we, we could tape it and, and do it here sometime. That would be fun. Is there any like certain colors you wanna dye up? Yeah. What colors? Really wanna do like a silver or like charcoal or maybe like a little blue or maybe like a little red. Okay. Really a dark, dark yellow. Any certain weight of yarn? Soft weight. Soft fingering weight? Yeah. Yeah? Are you looking are you looking forward to making a pair of socks? No, I wanna make like that type of hat I made for me. Oh, you, you wanna do a sock head hat? Finger weight. Finger weight. Yes, finger weight yarn. Um Yeah. So I am going to be knitting we do a lot of eating, and we even have them bring us a, um, a projection screen, and we watch movies on the projection screen while we're knitting the whole time. What are you doing? Oh, this is Winnie. Winnie, stop loving the camera. Hey, Winner. This is our little five-month-old French bulldog. Six. No, she's not six months yet. Mm -mm. This is who. This is who you could hear snoring the whole time in the last episode. <laughs> and she snores even with her eyes open. Um, I had to comment on our shirts. Show me shirt. We are very much a house divided. So funny that we both had them on the same day. Um, what you knitting on, Ben? My Seahawks hat. Ben is a Seattle Seahawks fan. So, uh, since he wasn't really feeling the knit knitting and had never done a circular project before, I helped him. I cast it on his hat. 
and got him started with a few rows. And what is with all the faces? I didn't make any. I was drinking and I got some of the lip glow and wiped it off. Okay. Um, show me your hat. You got this. It's a pattern where you go three knit, two pearl, three knit, two pearl. It's a free pattern off of Ravelry. Um, I think it's called the Boyfriend Hat. I've made a, probably three or four of them. Um, it's by, I gotta look, Stephanie Nicole Bennett. He does the Boyfriend Hat. So this is his first attempt at a hat. And he's pretty excited about it. Um, pretty good. We were out to Walmart the other day. And I had some of the lime green. You can go ahead and if you want. I had some lime green in, in my stash. That did not look good at all. And when we were at Walmart the other day, he goes, this one match matches my stuff better. So we had to get some cheap yarn out to Walmart. He's still in, in his cheap yarn phase, but that's okay because we can't keep him knitting long enough to to justify some fancy, smancy yarn. Maybe we have to do, ooh, we should do that sometime. A trip to the yarn shop. So what else do you have going on this week? I owe assessments. You have Iowa assessments, which is what? Our state testing that we have to take. Which is... So what did, what did they say about that? Mm, just that we... It's a new type of test, and... It's what we're doing all week. It's gonna suck. <laughs> Don't say suck. It's better than what you said last time. Okay, you need to try. Don't look at yourself. You can look at yourself in the playback. What happened last week? I have assessment prep. <laughs> Did you have a concert? No, I didn't. I thought that was last week. No, I'm pretty sure it was two weeks ago. I thought it was last week that you had an honor choir concert. No, because it was only he sings. first. Maybe he'll sing for you sometime. No. No? No. Maybe. No. No? No. What's your favorite stuff to sing? Old school. Old school. What's considered old school to you? ACDC, Queen. It's not like the Beatles or anything like that. I like the Beatles. I like Chuck Berry. That's what I would consider old school. You like... <sighs> I, I, you like Journey. We sing a lot of Journey in the car. I do like, well, I only know, like, really know one good one. What did we watch last week that you were dying to watch? Bohemian Rhapsody. Yes, we did watch Bohemian Rhapsody. You liked it? I loved it. You did like it a lot. It was good. I thought it was a little slow at times, but I really, I mean, I enjoyed it. I can see why, um, dog. I can see why he won so many awards for the lead, and why it got so many awards. It was it was good. Mm -hmm. It was awesome. Um, quit putting your mouth in front of your or hand in front of your mouth. <laughs> you just keep staring at yourself, <laughs> Goober. Um, what else? Mm hmm. you're looking at. I'm looking up and I'm thinking. It's like we're keeping you from a nap today. Did you have too many chores to do? No. Too much roller skating over the last couple days? No. No. Well, maybe I'll move on to some of my finishes. Does that sound good? Sure. Like 
the worst episode ever because you <laughs> don't smile <laughs> and you seem like I'm forcing you at gunpoint to do this. Mm, that's, mm, don't say that. Why are you not smiley today? You're always smiley. <laughs> All right. Since I was a knitting robot this week, unlike, what are you doing here, robot? <laughs> it's gonna be our screenshot. Um, unlike him, who no, I literally no, no, what? No. What? It's not called a screenshot. It's called a thumbnail. Oh, such terminology. So thumbnail, not scream the shot, and yep. not show notes. It's called description. Then yeah. like, notifications, subscribe. Okay, we'll get to that later. And then dislike, not on see any of that. Um, <laughs> haters gotta hate. We info, had that conversation the other day about haters. Uh, <laughs> He's comments. To, comments. Comments are good. We got we got a few good comments last time. Okay, I'm gonna go into all this. I had started these previously at a retreat. I had one done, They're and the cuff of the second. They're so comfortable. They are. You want to try them on? So I had I'll, decided. I'll be, I'll be I had decided that I needed to finish. <laughs> You're gonna be my model. I decided that I needed to get these done and get these finished since it's been a lovely winter here in Iowa. <laughs> um, those are the Seed Stitch Mittens by the Bead Knitter. I think that's what it's by. <laughs> the, the yarn is Claudia Hand Painted Yarns. It's awesome. 100% Merino. And the color Thick. is Ruby's Playing. It's a free pattern, so... Look at those. Yep. It's a free pattern. So anybody can go get it off of Ravelry. Um, comfy? You like mm -hmm. them? So after I get done with these, from the same skein, I had so much left. I can't remember how many yarns came. Oh, it comes in 350 yards. So that's quite a bit of yarn. It's super washed, hand dyed. Um, there's quite a bit of yarn left over, so I decided to make the most comfiest hat make ever. a hat. This just came so this week. Yes, so I got I made a matching hat. I'm gonna model this too. You were quite the little supermodel. <laughs> now turn to the side so I can actually see the hat. Ouch! <laughs> there you go. Which the hat is the copycat CC Beanie, and it's also a free pattern. So we've been going to get that. It's by Emily Ingrid from Clementine Knits and Crochet. Um, I thought that, I thought it kind of matched the seed sit, stitch pattern stripes of the mittens. They're gonna put those back on too. So I thought they made a good set together. Um, I had a couple. Um, pom poms, furry pom poms, ordered off of Etsy. They were not going to get here in time to finish and show the hat. <laughs> so I actually went on Amazon and there was like a 12 pack of miscellaneous furry pom poms for super cheap. It was, I don't remember how cheap it was, but I'll put the link. And it's got this one. I'm not in love with this pom pom, I think it needs to be a little bigger. I think he's perfectly fine. I think it needs to be a little bigger. But you got a bunch of different colors to choose from. So we'll see. I don't Jazz know. Hands. If... <laughs> Jazz hands. There you go. Um, I don't know if we're going to keep it on at all. Just abusing the mittens. Throw them on the floor. I don't know if we're going to keep it on there or not. But. I thought that was pretty good though. One skein of yarn. I don't remember the price of it. It wasn't that all that expensive. But one skein got me a hat and mittens that perfectly match. Oh, 
I see a piece of something on there from some. Oh, that wasn't what you dropped. <laughs> No. 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 I dropped the middens. So yeah, that was the first things I finished this week. So, as if that's not enough, I picked up an old project. Oh, I should have brought my yarn over. I don't think I brought it over. Oh, maybe I did. I did. Old project bag I made a while ago. Um, I actually like the sugar skulls. Yes, it was sugar skulls. I'm one of those people that has to have project bags and progress keepers that tend to theme up each project just to make it a little more fun. Um, so, so you choose sugar skulls for this one for what you know, reason? I don't know why this actually happened to be in there. This is the next skein. I'm just, almost done with the rope. I just think it's so pretty and so fall-like. I had a sock done where I had already almost turned the heel. And had the top done. Gotta pull this one. Here's the next thing I got done I'm for the week. Done with the row. These are. Shut I'm gonna put it up there so you can see it a little closer. They're huge. They're Look. not huge. Well, that I'd watch out so you don't put the write sock. It down. Don't put the sock in my teeth. You know what? I didn't write it down. Who it's by? These are the Clark socks. They're really cool because they have, I don't know, let me take it off. They have the cross oh, the middle. Those are cables. Cross middle? Is that is that your nickname for it? Yeah, it's like a, or like a French braid. Kind of looks like a French braid. It has the cables down the front. Why did I We say haven't French? learned cables yet, have we? I'm on cables. No, you're on cable needles. Cables are this. And it has a cable in the back. So I really like it. Um, I will put the link in the All I care about show is notes. This. No! <laughs> you should put them in the description. Cable runs all the way down the front. The back one stops at the top of the heel. Um, I, switched, I switched the heel from what it called for to the Fish Lips Kiss heel. Um, just because it's my favorite heel to do. I think, I'm thinking about froggy in it. You think about ripping it out? No, you don't get to rip my sock out. So anyway, I finished yeah. this this week. I had down to about here. And so I finished all of that this week. And then <sighs> cast it on numero dos so that I, I get going on the second one and don't get second sock syndrome. So this I've been working on. It sucks. Yeah, so you know what second sock syndrome is? Yeah, it's you forget about the second sock. Yeah, you just don't want to do it. So, like I got this one sock. It'll see, be a, we it'll always be the said because we do a lot of first socks, so we always said it would be good if we knew somebody that just needed one sock, or that didn't care if their socks match, or didn't care what their socks match. So then they we just we so never have to saying, do second socks. So you're saying you're evil clone? No, because I'm pretty sure evil clone doesn't care about that because that's why there's a whole basket downstairs. Oh, dissing the laundry skills now. Roasting. Burn. <laughs> Goober. So this yarn is so heavenly. Let's see if I got the tag in there. Um, it's Adam and Eve. Adam and Eve yarns. I had ordered it for a lot a while ago from River Wait. City Knits, which Grocery Girls made me do it because they had it on there, and that's where they. I don't know if they still work there, but they used to work. Um, Tracy used to work at the shop occasionally. Um, Wait, R River City? They live in Iowa? No, they live in Canada. Canada. But it's oh, it's River City Yarns is what it is. Is the name of the sharp the shop? I think sharp sharp. Um, but the yarn itself is Dude. merino, cashmere, and nylon. Nylon. It, it definitely it definitely sounds French. Cashmere sounds French. Yeah. No. I don't know what cashmere is. French? Is it goats? Goats? It's an animal? Uh, yeah, what do you think merino is? Merino's a sheep. Oh, <laughs> uh, really? Well, that's not a goat! <laughs> Where do you think wool comes from? 
That comes from a sheep. Well, merino is a type of sheep. <laughs> you didn't know that? And did you not know that, really? Yeah. I'm not teaching you very well then. All right, anyway, so Happy it is ever. the colorway red fox. Red fox, red fox. So Adam and yeah, Eve yeah, yeah, yeah. yarn, colorway red fox from was it was River, it? River City Yarns. And they will ship. That's how I got mine. I didn't go to Canada. Yeah, so. we don't want we don't want to hear any story. What? Nothing. <laughs> what? Nothing. Were Adam right. and Eve the first so. people on Earth? Yes. Um, as if that's not enough, then I also, see what I mean? He hardly knitted all this week. I knit a ton. Um. She got a sleeve done. Time to model. Time. Oh, you're going to model this too? Okay. This one that I've been working on is The Nurtured by Andrea Mowry. This is a pay for pa pattern. I think the rest of the patterns I did, well, the Clark socks might be a play paid for pattern too. I think almost everything else is a free pattern. Um, I'll link it below. This in the description. Let's show it up close. Is a fun little four row repeater. It looks like a knit, 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 knit. It's not. There's some purling and slipping in there. Um, yeah. But it's a bottom up sweater. So. She starts from the bottom of the sleeve and goes this. all the way up top, and then you do the other sleeve go all the way up top, Shh. and then you go from the sweater all so the way do the top, first, you and do then you knit this top into the other part of the sweater. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> I did it. So, I did this first sleeve first and finished my first sleeve finally. I got my middle started first because I don't follow directions, and instead of casting on my sleeves first... I jumped right to the middle very first and went back and started my first sleeve. So now I also. It's not bulky, it's just because my sleeves are yeah, and I Cast it on my second sleeve. Which. <laughs> I got my middle armor. I stole this idea from a friend who's also knitting the same sweater to put a little clip with all the little light bulb progress keepers. Light and. Bulb. Yeah, they're in the shape of a light bulb. So that's why they're light, light bulb. bulb. Um, to mark, instead of having to count all the time how many repeats I do, and it's visually easier to mark out, to measure out, when you only very have to do an inch in between. This, so the way, then I end up having 12 of them. Warm. You like it? You're not going to wear my sweater. Oh, I am. Um, this I'm doing... Oh, yeah, I see. There's, there's, the, there's, there's an actual book. skein. This I'm doing in Malabrigo Rios. Oh, and the colorway. This is Malabrigo. Isn't it soft? Is this Malabrigo? Feel free to fondle, yes. Yeah, it's all Malabrigo. No, 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 no. We don't touch. Nice. Nice yarn. I'm not going to say fondle. Fondle. So, no. the color, 846 Winter Lake. Which I'm not sure it's why it's Winter Lake. I guess there is some blues and purples in there. I think it's more gray. It looks purple on the screen though, so I don't know. It's a nice quit it. You're gonna make it pill. Pill? Pill. We'll we'll cover that later. Um here you go. <laughs> fold it small enough. So yeah. I got a lot done this week. I didn't I kinda did. Mm, no. So you're gonna get more done next it. week. Yes, you did not work on your blanket. No, but I need to. Yes. So now you're just focused on your hat. I think Ooh, that's what I'll bring. I did it fun mail yesterday. Did I bring it over? It was this. No. Well, I got those two. Nope, this is what I'm talking about. Wait, wait, wait. Pew, pew. I think it looks like a laser gun. <laughs> okay, no. No, no. Don't abuse the sock blockers. Um... <laughs> <laughs> Why is that funny? So, fun mail today, and I'm super excited about this. Unboxing sisters. <laughs> Sexy. 
I like progress keepers <laughs> in all of my in all of my projects. Usually, I will have three wait. progress keepers. Wait, 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 wait. What? Quick thing. Before this, uh, when you're gonna comment. A Ben tangent. We haven't had one of these yet. Comment in five seconds to guess what type of progress keeper it is. In five, four, three, two, one, done. If you think you got it, you're fine. <laughs> yeah, no. Um, okay, so the progress keeper. I like to have, like I was saying, I like to have three progress keepers usually so that I can see how much progress I had last time I knit and then I move it up when I'm done for the day. I know, it's obsessive. And I just like to decorate my knitting. I also I also like to, I keep a little thing of some of my favorite perfumes in my notions bag. What? Move your finger. There's a donut. Yeah, they, she has all kinds of little stuff. Yeah, I want the donut. Um, I keep a little thing of perfume in my gotcha. notions bag and like to spray my my stuff I'm knitting on just so it smells good while it's in my hands and I'm knitting. I like things So smell. that's why you smell. Nice. <laughs> I like things that smell good and things that are pretty. So this is what is my thing. favorite dessert on the whole entire planet? Hmm, let me think. It's probably between cheesecake and cake. Oh, cheesecake. cheesecake. So, this was, came in the mail yesterday. It's from Sucre Sucre Miniatures. Chelsea. Chelsea at Sucre Sucre Miniatures has such a selection of the most adorable progress keepers. I believe she has jewelry, too. Um, I want that donut up that there. Is. It's really cool. It is cute. Um, she's out of Olympia, Washington, I believe. Mm. But these are polymer clay, and they look so real. Like, she's got cheeseburgers, and I think before Jill and I had ordered... Uh, slices of pumpkin pie. I'd ordered one for me and one for her and gave it to her like a couple falls ago. And she's got donuts and just the cutest I like the little... donut so badly. I'll have to look. So yes, I got... There's your donut right there. Up top. Let's see if I can get a picture. Yeah. I will put the link to her Etsy shop down below too. Um, there you go. That's exactly what They're such what good quality. Say. I've never had one break on me. I've ordered quite a few. Um, like and I've gotten had. Ben hooked on them as well, so now he knows how to decorate his projects. So we got the progress, the project bags, progress keepers, cute stitch markers. We just pretty don't know. He says I need to get him some more masculine progress keepers. Maybe I should see if she can make me a Hawkeye one. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Maybe, how about like a football? I have a football mm -hmm. in my collection. Maybe. Maybe. Hockey puck. Hockey puck. Or a hockey stick. You would probably want a stick though, it might get caught in your knitting. Yeah, exactly. Um, I don't know. Honestly, if you're a guy knitting, you're already, whatever you put in your knitting is masculine because it's a guy's knitting. Don't you agree? Kind of. You always say real men can wear pink. I had crack on my palette too. Okay, we got enough for the beginning of the video. Um, hmm. So, I think we're going to wrap it up for episode two. Um, give us some feedback. Let us know if there's anything else that you want to hear us talk about. Um, Make sure you follow on Ravelry. Why are you pulling me over here? You're just so far over there. Um, ben did get his Ravelry set up. Yeah, Little Ritz Knits. Little Ritz Knits. Yeah. And it's Knits with a Z. So he is officially a Ravelry member. You don't have any of your projects logged in there yet, though. We gotta get that done. Yeah, I only have one in there. You don't have anything in there. You just have your picture and it's set up. You have no projects. Oh well, yeah, that's true. So now you can put your boyfriend hat in there. And I'm Nitty Chick. K N I T T I E, chick. 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 On Ravelry. So, like us. And we're Mondays with Ben. We're not to that part yet. Why haven't you done that yet? Didn't we do that at the beginning? For Ravelry? We don't have a Ravelry for Mondays with Ben yet. Yeah, we need that one. 
We have an Instagram. We have an Instagram. You may you have to follow that. We have an Instagram Mondays with Ben. Which we will probably go live on occasionally. Maybe maybe. We'll maybe our next shopping trip we'll do live. Yes. So like us. Give us a comment. And subscribe. And turn that notification bell on. Make sure it has those two little dots or you're not getting us when it comes out. Come back and see us. We actually the other day have decided we don't know if we're going to do every Monday or every other Monday. Um, every I'm, other weekend. I'm with my father. Ben's with his dad. So it makes us a little hard to get together and knit and film. So we might switch to every other Monday. Still Mondays with Ben. Yeah. But might be every other Monday. And plus then you'll have more progress to show people. So that would be good. Right? Yep. Alright. So we will be able to do it next Monday too. Maybe. Oh yeah, we should. Mondays. Just look for us on Mondays. Mondays and Mondays. Mondays are Monday, fun days. Monday, Monday, Mondays. Bye. Adios. Adios.